teach you stuff. Oh, okay. The girl seems to have received a strange thank you gift from an academic researcher and is analyzing with Timaeus what those cards contained in the package are and what exact purposes they may serve. Wait, 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 so I'm I, My legs are so so I'm so sorry, Layla. You know, I accidentally started this in my main In my main or my main. And well I'm trying this out. I hope I don't fuck it up. So... So, Sucrose, the package you mentioned that you received before, it's not dangerous, is it? You need to be careful when you're opening packages. I once had a friend mail me some research materials, and all the bouncing around in transit caused a reaction. Once I opened it, oh, it let out a stench that could wake the dead. If your package contains anything like that, then maybe you should check with Albedo first and see what he thinks. No. This package didn't contain any hazardous materials. Tomatoes! So gross! What are you two chatting about? Oh, hey, you two. Uh, we're just talking about a strange package that Sucrose received recently. A strange package? Yes. I believe it's from a Sumero scholar who came here to study in Mondstadt. It's most likely a thank you gift for collaborating on some research together. I love her voice. Huh? A package from an academia scholar? Oh, then there could be anything inside. Well, it is a thank you gift. Oh god, my ether has this voice. There wasn't anything dangerous inside. Just a bunch of strange cards. I think I've seen Timaeus with some similar looking cards before. So I came to ask him about what they might be. Uh, you've, you've seen me with some cards? <laughs> Maybe those were the testing cards used for distinguishing reagents. Maybe. No, they didn't look like test cards. Here, have a look. Oh, it's a gross size. It's a gross size. Oh, and you have, you have a card for yourself? Of your own? What? Okay. That's so pretty. Okay, wait, never mind. I've seen this from an event. They had a TCG event. Oh, like... you meant these? Huh. Sucrose, have you really never seen these before? No, never. Recently, I've been spending all my time up in the mountains working on cultivating pentatonic sweet flowers. Why? Is this an area of research that has started trending in the alchemical community during my absence? <laughs> you could definitely say that it's trending, but not as an area of research. It's a card game that's been getting really popular these days. It's called Genius Invocation TCG. Genius Invocation TCG. Genius Invocation TCG! So that's my one. So this is the game we've been hearing about? Genius what now? Yeah, we've been hearing about this game all over the place. But this is the first time we've ever actually seen any of the cards. I can't do voices. But also I... Never mind. Never you didn't mind. know it had made it all the way to Mondstadt. Must be pretty popular, huh? That's right. The game's been catching on lately. The Yae Publishing House in Inazuma has even published a series of light novels based on the game. The story is really good. I've heard about it. It starts yeah. with a young guy in Sumeru who finds an ancient casket of tomes in the attic. He opens it and discovers that the soul of an ancient TCG player called the Crocodile King has been captured inside. It turns out that the Crocodile King was King Deshret's Viceroy, who battled an opponent named the Ibis King. During the match, the Crocodile King fell prey to his opponent's scheme and was sealed away in the Casket of Tomes. After being unexpectedly released by the kid, the Crocodile King possesses him and helps him to gradually climb the ranks and become a legendary TCG player. Uh, Timaeus. Huh? What's wrong, Sucrose? Uh, oh, if you're interested in how the story plays out, I can lend you the novels. You have those? 
No. I was just thinking about that time you requested an extension on your progress report deadline, citing personal reasons for the delay. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> well, uh, I did go through a phase recently where I wasn't putting enough focus on my work, but it's under control now. I've committed to not even touch Genius Invocation TCG until I've made enough progress in my research. <sighs> well, that's unfortunate. Oh? Why? Why is that? Yeah. Why? Well, since it's a gift from a researcher I've collaborated with, I thought that I should at least try to learn the rules. That way, I could say that I at least tried to appreciate his gift. Oh, right! So and since it's a game from Sumeru, who knows? Playing it might even make you smarter! If you want to play, then just say it. Then you desperately need to play this game. Okay, fine! Paimon's curious and would like to give it a try. Please? Although... It seems like we can't learn how to play it anytime soon, cause... Timaeus has given up for a while. <laughs> well, research is my priority, you know. But, if you'd like to learn the rules of Genius Invocation TCG, then I'd actually suggest you go to the Cat's Tale. The Cat's Tale? That's Margaret's place. Yep, that's the place. It's where everyone in the community goes to play when they have time. They gather there, trade cards, and they're very welcoming to new players. Trying to learn the rules can be intimidating at first, but it's a lot of fun once you get the hang of it. Understood. Traveler? Paimon? Let's go to the cat's tail and try asking around. Okay. To be honest, hearing Timaeus talking about the game has also piqued my curiosity. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get going! And then... Battlefield of Dice, Cats and Cards. Go to cat's tail. Is it... Oh, there. Dumbass. Okay. Well. Huh, oh, okay, I hope. Yeah. Let's go to Cat's Tail, <laughs> just like so close to it. It's that we could f Oh my gosh, that's a different door. That's not the door I know. <laughs> I don't think so. Never mind, maybe I'm just imagining stuff. Also, can finally enter Cat's Tail! Oh, Margaret! Welcome to the Cat's Tail! Ah! <laughs> it's the Traveler and Paimon! What a nice surprise! Oh! And Sucrose the Alchemist! It's been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> I'm afraid I've already told you before. Fur from the Cat's Tail staff is not for sale, no matter how much Mora you offer. Uh, don't worry, Margaret. We're not here for that research project I told you about last time. Oh, uh, what research project? Fur from the Cat's Tail staff? Uh, Sucrose, what kind of experiment were you trying to do with the Cat's Tail? Uh, oh, I just wanted to test out some hypotheses. And I needed some materials. But, uh, we can talk about that later. Actually, Margaret, we're here to learn more about Genius Invocation TCG. Sucros explains everything to Margaret. Ah, Genius Invocation TCG. We were just talking about that game. You see, more and more people have been gathering at the Cat's Tail to play. So I thought, why not have a dedicated staff to serve the new customers? Speaking of which, I believe you've already met. Hmm? Met who? You know, Prince. This is the cat's tail yeah. after all. So I thought having a cat take care of our new customers would be quite a nice touch. Meow. Just a meow. Ah, allow me to interpret. <clears throat> Prince says that the word customer is much too loose of a term, and we should instead refer to anyone who loves dueling with cards as TCG players. Hmm, <laughs> my mistake. So it seems I haven't introduced you yet. This is Prince and Shuyin. 
They will be in charge of taking care of our TCG players. Is she from Liyue? Ah, I'm afraid I must correct you there, ma'am. Only Prince, the strongest and most formidable TCG player of all, is capable of providing valuable guidance to our new players. The average player is incapable of grasping the subtlety and sheer genius behind Prince's every play, and he has no choice but to rely on me to communicate with everyone. I am merely Prince's lowly assistant, that's all. Okay, roleplay. Wow! Another guy who can understand animals! Okay. How can you use such a crude word as animal to describe the one and only Prince? He is special and the only one of his kind. Such a remark is an insult to Prince. Meow. Meow. Oh, what's that? Shu Yen. In the eyes of the common folk, I look I no different than any Seriously. other ordinary cat. It's a natural mistake to make and you shouldn't overreact. Ah, understood. I do apologize. Okay, sh sure. Hmm. Oh my gosh. It seems he really is capable of communicating with the cat. Could this be the result of some modification to the language center of his brain? Seriously, how can he get all of that from a simple meow? Amazing. That's pretty weird. Uh, yes, sure. it was the Later. sacred duels of genius invocation, TCG, that formed and cemented our bonds Where of mutual understanding. It's my firm belief that by simply playing the game, players can develop a deeper level of understanding between one another. Okay. So, playing Genius Invocation TCG fosters some sort of a telepathic link between players? Hmm, somehow Pylon doubts that. Uh-huh. Anyway, if you'd like to know anything about Genius Invocation TCG, then please ask Shuyan. Uh, who will ask Prince? Though I'd love to explain more myself, it's time for my daily walk. I'll let Prince play a game with you and walk you through all the rules. Just as a seasoned warrior can foresee the path of his opponent's sword, so too can I, as a TCG master, predict my opponent's every play. It would be improper to pit a newcomer to the art of the card against one such as myself. And I must therefore politely decline. <clears throat> That's what Prince said. Uh oh, Prince doesn't want to play with us, huh? Fine, then Prince doesn't have to. We'll play you instead. I'm sorry, but from the day I met the mighty card master Prince, I swore an oath that my hands would live solely to hold the cards and not to play them. I will never play another match of my own again. Right, Prince's boss can probably can't hold the cards. What a backstory. If Prince is unwilling to play, then I guess we should look for an alternative. Hmm. <gasps> How about this? Diona! Yeah, blah, 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 what is it? I'm pretty busy over here, you know? She's been down there the whole time. Huh. Why is it that every player that sets foot in here to play Genius Invocation TCG has to have a drink? Ugh. Don't they have any clue that the key to playing a game is the ability to think straight? Well, not seriously. Straight. Games and drinks don't mix. Don't they get that? Ugh. Well, yes, I'm nervous. What year. can I say? As the tavern owner, I can't help but feel happy to hear this. Anyway, I see you've been working hard, so I thought you could use a break. So why not come over here and teach these customers <gasps> the rules of genius invocation? Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> my dog. My dog. Are you okay? Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. You're okay. Oh my gosh, okay. Ha! <laughs> yeah, what kind of break is that? No, seriously. I'd rather not. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. What kind of break is Oh. Why are we letting all these loafers come in here to play Genius Invocation TCG anyway? All it does is encourage more people to come to the bar for a drink. <sighs> you know, if drink sales keep going up like this, Pretty soon, Mondstadt's alcohol industry is going to reach new heights! <sighs> <sighs> huh. 
Looks like my first step in destroying Mondstadt's alcohol industry should be stamping out the spread of Genius Invocation TCG. My dear, you are quite Come mistaken. You said it yourself, a clear mind is necessary to win. Soon, their thirst for victory will overcome their thirst for alcohol. Aww. Prince speaks the truth, Diona. Not only is the spread of Genius Invocation TCG no obstacle to your goal of destroying Mondstadt's alcohol industry, it could even support you in this endeavor. C could it really? <laughs> sure, why not? Alrighty then, our two customers are waiting to learn. Shuyin, let's put you on drink mixing duty for now. But Shu Yen is destined for a far greater purpose. Shu Yen, drink mixing now. Oh, okay. Ooh, all right. We'll need some space to learn. <laughs> Let's go to that empty table over there. That was a lot of stuff to that tap bit. Okay. Hi, Prince. Was Diana here this whole time? Would have been fun if they showed like just her tail here <laughs> while they were doing the cutscene, be uh, cutscene the conversation before she appeared. What's your name? Diana's waiting for you. Okay. Go talk to her and she'll teach you the rules of the game. Th That's what Prince said. <sighs> and I need to go start mixing drinks. It's a pity that I can't look on while you learn. Uh, sure, okay. So even if I talk to you, you're gonna say the same thing? That's Bestie. what Prince- I was talking to you, not Prince. Okay. Be who? Be who? Gary? Oh, I'm so sorry, that's so good. I will surely defeat all my opponents just like how I chase down prey. And I'll become the best genius invocation TCG player in no time left. Hmm? You're interested in the game too? But you're not a player yet, are you? <laughs> when you become a true TCG player, you might even get the chance to duel me. Yeah, probably. What's your name? Uh, Wonder and Cats. Oh yeah, speaking of wonder, holy shit, I can't decide a fucking name, and that's why I can't- I still can't do this quest. Yeah, I just- I just want to give him the, a nice name that fits with the story, but also- wait, that's the wrong one. But also, like, come on, I, I can- I can only do it once, I don't wanna use the extra stuff to rename him again. Ah, oh, seriously. Hi, Diana. Wait, I to talk to hear this. Hey there, up for a game of cards? Hold on, I don't think you're an official player yet. Come find you once you've become an official player. Perhaps there'll be something I can learn from your mistakes. Which what? Okay, that's sure. Makri. A new player, huh? You can ask Kruyan about the rules of the game. But if there's other things you wish to know, you're always welcome to come and ask. Oh, how nice of you. People from different walks of life. <laughs> okay, let's go through the rules. First things first. You'll be needing your deck, so place that on the table. Uh, deck? Cards. Uh, yes. You should have built a deck. You know, a set of cards that meets the bare minimum requirement to play the game. Uh, what's with the blank stairs? Come on! Don't tell me you came to learn Genius Invocation TCG Louise. without bringing any cards! Louise, actually, we do have some cards. Don't you have a practice deck we could try? What do you mean, we? It's just the gross cards. That's right! We have some cards that I received from a friend. Uh, yeah. You're gonna need a few more cards than that. Where did I even get them? Wait, from okay, friends? let me think. <sighs> <sighs> to learn the game, you'll need at least two character cards to switch between. Oh, oh, that reminds me! A few days ago, when I was closing up for the night, I noticed a customer had left a couple of character cards on the bar counter! <laughs> Maybe you could use those for now! 
Are you sure that's okay? I'm hungry. <laughs> eh, it's already been a few days and he still hasn't come back to claim them. Who knows? Maybe he left them here on purpose. Maybe? Oh, okay, yeah, I got them here with me. You know, just in case the customer came looking for them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not because I like to play the game or anything. <laughs> Please. Why did that remind me of Ito? <gasps> Alright, so now we have two character cards. That's everything we need, right? Oh, Paimon, we need support cards. From my knowledge at the web event. Yep. So, are Never you ready to what? start? <laughs> I'm ready. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm, 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 I'm not ready. I was wrong. I'm ready. Alright, then let's begin. I thought you needed support cards. Oh, dear. Okay. What oh, is such a cute tutorial skin? Tutorial skin. <laughs> welcome! You... Welcome to the world of Genius Invocation TCG! Do you look at Kai? Simply put, this is a game where you control character cards to duke it out with your opponent! Pew pew pew! You I mean? Oh, we should... Once you've defeated it. all of your opponent's character cards, victory shall be yours! Now then, you're gonna need a character on the field to start with. So like do good for us in action. Let's go. Time is against us. Wait, who's for who's wait? First, we roll eight elemental dice at the start of every round. Okay. I really have to okay. Um why do I keep These cursing? dice correspond to elemental energy. We'll be spending these dice to perform actions. Once the roll phase is over, you'll enter the action phase, where the real game starts! During the action phase, you can spend elemental dice to perform various actions. Of course, the most common action is to use character skills. I'm just looking at the UI. Check rolls. Okay, whatever. That looks... Oh. I don't know what these are. What's like the amount of... Huh? Oh, yeah? Oh, so you need three for the skill and then... Okay, okay. Uh... It was cross three, but I should have read this. Okay. Huh. I don't know if I can... Huh. Not bad. You just made your first attack! I thought the other one was the first, but okay. During the action phase, both sides will take turns making their moves. After you use a skill to attack your opponent, it's their turn to attack. I'll switch character, I guess. Oh, so also that's like the house. And as you can see, once the enemy finishes their move, it's our turn again. Okay. Yeah, you can use the Omni for the S. Yeah. Now, these are Omni Element Dice. They can be spent on any move regardless of the elemental type. Yep. So, we're gonna use them to pay for the Pyro Dice needed for this skill. Go on, give it a try. Wait, why do I have d look when you hate d look? Well, not, not hate exactly, but you know. Okay. Wait, hmm. I... Okay, no, no, I think I got it. <sighs> <laughs> that was pretty good! That's one opponent down for the count! Ba-bam! What's, what's but the game start? has only just begun! Remember? You have to defeat all opponents to win! I don't have the dice for Kai or D look. How do I, like, roll dice? Hmm. As much as we'd like to attack again, seems like we've run out of usable dice! I'm on huh. fire? In that case, let's end this round. Eh? After you end round, you won't be able to do anything else this round. And once everyone chooses end round, oh. we can move on to the next round. Okay, that's dope. That's my head. Ouch. Oh, stop hitting. <gasps> All right! Here we are, a fresh new round! Woohoo! <laughs>
And a fresh new round means time to roll the dice again. That's how we're gonna get the elemental energy we need, after all. So what, like, every round means, like, every roll that I spent. <laughs> That's so satisfying. Ooh, that's some terrible luck. Well, there's no way we'll be able to use... But don't worry. Oh, shit, Situations sorry. like these are why we have the option to... Reroll! <laughs> Once per round, you can select all the dice that you don't like and reroll them. How many? Okay, now I'm ready to take me to seven. Okay, oh well, sure. When the action phase begins, the player who first chose N round in the previous round takes their turn first. So me. This means that since you finished first the last round, you'll be the first to start this round. Alrighty then, let's learn a little bit about energy and elemental bursts. Each time you use a skill, your character will gain one energy. Why does they want to sound different? Or am I just tripping? Do I still read those stuff? This? Okay, two when energy. Steve's energy is full, he can use a powerful elemental burst. But we're still one short. Never mind. Let's start with a normal attack instead. Deluxe's normal attack only needs one pyro die and two other dice of any type. Okay. In any case, your normal attack needs fewer pyro dice than your elemental skill. Wait, what? Okay. Jeez. Okay, no ways. Okay. I'm just like, I'm just gonna run out of some energy. Okay, this is never good. Same thing. <laughs> Oopa. Rip. <laughs> <laughs> now we have three energy plus. We have enough pyro elemental dice left over. Yeah, we do. It's time to use four, right? we need your four. powerful elemental burst! Yes. Your verdict is. Verdict is wrong. Oh. Miniature. When a miniaturized dice shaker to the next battle. Switching characters and elemental reactions. With oh, switching characters, okay. Yeah. Kaya didn't get to shine. In an actual game of Genius Invocation TCG, you need to use multiple character cards to form a party. <laughs> Next up, it's time for your second character card, Kaya, to take the stage. Yeah. Like, there's a NPC. NPC. Aw. Oh. The took signals pictures for the card. Is that it? Wait, then they just took random oh, pictures. It seems yeah. like any move by Kai is gonna cost quite a lot of cryo dice. Okay. Not cryo and not viral. Okay. Okay, okay we can. Get me able only once. Three, three dice. When you deal cryo damage, you'll cause your target to be affected by cryo. Yeah. Okay. Freeze. What's this? Two, only two dice, or two something else? <laughs> Good. Now our opponent is affected by cryo. This is a good time to learn about oh, elemental reactions. Well, different types of elemental damage affect enemies with different elements. When a character is affected by certain elemental combos, an elemental reaction will be triggered. Like what? At the moment, your opponent is affected by cryo, so we should try and use a pyro skill on them. Looks like we have to switch active characters, though. Oh, that reminds me. Both sides must have one active character, while others are considered standby characters. Active right now. Yep, I know. That's obvious. Normally, we can only use the active character skills. Now, if we want to use the skills of our standby character, 
we'll have to switch them to the active character. In this case, we'll have to switch to D Luke in order to use his skills. That's our. <laughs> okay, ah, oh, so that's the first, like, the, the first one. I thought you can spend Easter. one elemental die of any kind to switch a standby character to the active character. Oh, any kind. Okay, so you have to use a die. Why is it named die? Seriously. Let's finish this swiftly. <laughs> Switching characters is an action just like using a skill. So once it's done, it's your opponent's turn. That's okay. I mean, sure. Pull up lata. Most skills can only target the active character. As you can see, your opponent just attacked D Luke. All right then. Now that D Luke is our active character, Wait. it's time to use his skill. I was paying attention. Did it say like it can only attack the active character? Yeah, see. Because the opponent is already affected by cryo, oh, yeah. dealing pyro damage triggers the melt elemental reaction. When triggered, melt increases damage dealt by two. This will allow you to deal loads of damage in one go. <laughs> genius Invocation's elemental reaction system is pretty cool, huh? So you do like Genius Invocation. Ah. <laughs> Victory, in a tutorial. Tutorial. Action cards. There you go, the support stuff. That's what I was thinking. I All right. <laughs> Next up, let's learn how to use card types <gasps> other one. than character cards. I love this in the web event. So These cards are all known as action cards. Each time a match starts, you have to draw five action cards to form your starting hand. Uh oh, looks like we don't have any elemental dice we can spend to make an attack. Oh, you can roll it. Okay, that answers my question. Oh no. Oh no. What? <laughs> Seriously? We still don't have any usable dice even after that reroll? Well, huh, never mind. Even in cases like this, we can still attack. We just need to put the action cards in our hand to good use. Don't underestimate action cards. They can grant all kinds of support and buffs to your active character. Take this one, for example. So playing this action card will require two of these. Uh, see the symbol? Yeah, that means you'll need to play elemental dice of the same type. Okay. Some other cards will cost you these instead. The cost requirements for these are much more lenient. What? You can spend any kind of elemental dice. What? Oh, these? They're much more lenient. Lenient? So this is our lenient? What? We'll cross that bridge when we get there, though. For now, just play this action card. Cute. Okay. It needs to do the same type. I probably won't remember this stuff but maybe so playing an action card from your hand is a form of fast action fast actions do not end your current turn playing an action card. simply put you could continue to act even after playing an action card well then <laughs> you have your blade time to test it out but wait d luke's elemental skill costs three pyro dice and right now we don't even have one well not a problem. This is where we can use a more advanced mechanic known as elemental tuning. By discarding one card from your hand, you can convert one elemental die into the element of your current active character. Uh, and this card isn't useful right now. So we might as well use it for elemental tuning. Oh shit, I clicked off. Uh. Gosh, also oh, many things. Chain one is it? Oh, you can only do one. Sometimes 
You won't be able to perform any actions you want to because you didn't roll the elemental dice you wanted. Oh well. Moving on. Ingenious invocation, TCG. Keeping up a constant flow of combat is much more important than the number of cards you have. In this case, well, <laughs> let's just take all these useless cards and use them for elemental tuning. Call this useless. Just like playing cards from your hand, elemental tuning is a fast action. Come on, hurry up! Use elemental tuning to get yourself three pyro dice. Well, 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 would oh, you look at it. that! So Finally! Oh shit, I'm so sorry, Diana. Yeah. Because you have the white iron greatsword equipped, searing onslaught will deal one extra damage! What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> So proud of him. Really? That's so cool. Oh, victory and tutorial. Where's the expected and final test? Okay, gosh, having to learn a new now game. Now comes the final part. Oh, oh yeah! In a real match, you can make adjustments to your initial hand. This card uses the crimson witch. At this time, we can select any number of cards in our hand to shuffle back into the draw pile, and then draw the same number of new cards. What? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, you draw back. What? I don't know how my input. Oh, oh, that's good. Once you have confirmed any adjustments you wish to make to your starting hand, both players have to select their starting active character at the same time. Okay. Oh boy, this one's a real doozy. We gotta take it out pronto. Let's see how you do this time. Remember, start by selecting your initial starting character. Let's go. We have to press here. Or like, I can double click here. So, I choose him as the active character. Cool. Okay, might as well reroll. Uh, reroll. Oh. Oh, hey, that's pretty good. I just want one electro. Hey, hey, look at you! You sure are getting the hang of these rolls. Now let me teach you one last trick. Free of charge. Thanks. You can preview your opponent's actions. I mean, that is to say, you can read their intent. So for NPCs? Check it out. So here's where you can see all your opponent's intentions for this round. All your opponent's intended what? actions for the round will be listed here, in order. Reference this to come up with effective countermeasures and easily defeat your opponents. Yes, bigger helps. Him. Well then, that's the end of the tutorial. You're on your own from here. May victory be yours! Okay, imagine I finally lose in the tutorial round. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I have to use one die for it, so like it's two, two is for an attack. Why is this making my nervous? Uh-huh. I can't. Ready when you are. I, I, I don't know, I just... I'm gonna lose, I don't know. Wait, I forgot that. Ah, uh, you can. What's this? Oh, great sword. Oh, I should have killed him in it too. Dodge this! I just wanted the melt. That's why I was too impulsive. What does this do? Convert? <laughs> oh. Like the one dice? I already have one. <laughs> Wait, no, anywhere. Else. Okay. I end around here. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> There's one more thing I almost forgot. Oh, yeah, if, if I... Every time you hit an end phase, you get to draw two cards from your action cards pile. Okay. Remember, you have to make use of both your elemental dice and your action cards to win. Yeah, I didn't use it the last tutorial. Oh, so you can have more than five. That's good. So at the starting is five, and then you add more every round. Okay, not too good. I'm 
inventory as if I know shit. <laughs> okay, well, that's it. Oh, I have four. Yeah, yeah they ended their round first. Let's give this. Wait, what am I doing? How do I give it? Oh, here, okay. Oh, I need to. I don't. I have no idea what I'm doing. But this is fine, you know. Oh, I don't have. Oh, I should. Wait, should I do this? What's that? I know. What's that? Like? Converter. Oh. Wait, I think you need two of the same. Yeah. Yeah. Now, if I have to switch. You know what? Sure, if I. Imagine losing a tutorial. Yeah, I am. Let's go. Time is busy. I, I have to learn more about this. Oh, learn more? It's so sad. Should I have used this? Not that I have. Oh shit, okay. So I'm gonna reach. Okay, they're gonna do it first. Oh, should I like. I can't, I can't end my round first, like before my opponent. That's when I can do the first round, I guess. Oof, almost pressed the Omni. Sure. Three, uh, not really what I use. <laughs> What's this? Again? I can spend. Okay, okay. Is it here? Oh. There you go. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> wait, 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 so happy about it. Wait, actually, I have the look as my hair guy. Oh, wait, I'm gonna, it's gonna end, it's gonna die now. Can I use more than two action cards in one go? What's this? When I go to this, because it ends. It's just like my fucking head. The cryo, okay. It's Blizzard Strayer. And this here. Oh, heal. Okay. I don't really need to heal. I can. I can just use it. I'm gonna die anyway. <laughs> Kaya, Kaya, did we get to shine too much? Should I have just? Ah, oh, stayed. Wait, but I got a lot of crap. I mean, pyro. Genius invocation of TCG is a tightly paced, heart stopping tabletop card dueling game. I'm not gonna read it anymore. <laughs> yes. Just like what we did. We, we did all that. Oh, so it's, it's this deck for the people who skipped all of Diona's dialogue. You can declare on once you've been here. Okay, yeah. All right, cool. Those are the basics. Did you get all that? Yeah. Uh, what we just played was an adventure challenge designed specially for new players. Okay, what well, there's other? Genius Invocation TCG can be played in dual mode, where each player brings three character cards, or in adventure challenge mode, with a fixed deck for each challenge. It's a dual mode, and then. But I'm gonna learn the it rules are all the same. Just came as out. long as you understand the basics, then you should be able to take on any of those rowdy booze hounds. Although I feel there are still many details to grasp, I think I understand the basic premise of the game now. That was quite <gasps> the detailed explanation. I didn't know the Cat's Tales <gasps> famous mixologist had such an eclectic skill set. What? What? Oh! When did you get here? I stepped in while you were in the middle of your explanation. I hope I didn't dampen we the mood. We were using you. No, not at all. Wha 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 when did you get here? I want to do this. You have slow reactions. Wait. <gasps> Are you copying me? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> anyway, what are you doing here? <laughs> what are you doing? The cat's tail is a player in Mondstadt's alcohol industry. Naturally, you have some collaboration with my winery. I'm here today to discuss a few items of business with Margaret. 
Too bad she just uh, left. Yeah. But if you head off right yeah. now, you might still catch up with her. Never mind. It's nothing urgent. In fact, I think I'm now more interested yeah. in this card that you're using yeah. to teach them the game. <laughs> Two cards. Wait. Cards are cards. This card? It's Diluc's character card. Diluc. Cool. No, Although I have some degree of experience with Genius Invocation TCG, seeing this particular card is a first for me. Uh, a customer left it behind a few days ago, but he wasn't even playing the game while he was here. Oh? <laughs> and what sort of a customer was he? No, seriously. Uh, he wasn't wearing an eye patch, okay? <laughs> he had a light complexion and a super serious look on his face. He wasn't much of a talker oh and looked like he was just drinking his worries away. He never seen him around here before. Cool. Hmm. Eye patch, you say? I thought you said it's not. It does. Wait, am I even reading? Did I not read it? Did I not read it properly? I thought she said he's not wearing an eye patch. That's kind of no. There's no doubt about it. Gah! I was trying oh. to give the opposite description, but I Wait. just ended up giving it away. Sorry, guard captain. <laughs> so she's close with Kaya? Enough to say to do this. Don't worry. Somehow, I don't think he'll be giving you any trouble over it. So, what about the Dilu character card? And Kaya character card? Hello? I don't mind. It's just a card with my image yeah. on it. I didn't expect Dilu to be familiar with Genius Invocation TCG. The game has been catching on lately. It's hard to go anywhere without hearing it mentioned. Aww. Every now and then, I'll sit down and play a game with the customers in Angel Share. You're up for a game now? I challenge you to a I was hoping we could play a game. Oh. But this issue of someone leaving a character card with my image of the cat's tail is very intriguing. It's getting late, and someone has some explaining <laughs> to do. We'll have to have that duel another time. Sure, I look forward to it. I really do. Good. <laughs> then I'll take my leave. Why do you look? <laughs> Why? You know where the door is. Don't let the door hit you where Lord Barbado split you. What? Uh-oh. Guard oh. Captain. Oh? I hope Kaya will be all right. <laughs> oh, wait. I, I don't remember. Well, now that we are familiar with the rules, why don't we try playing a game of Genius and Vacation TCG? Cool. Ooh, two new players having their first ever duel! <laughs> this sounds like fun! You perked up real quick. But, in order to play an official duel, you need to have three character cards. We don't even have my own cards, okay? The two cards that we had were... Remember, a complete deck has Wait, to have what? three character cards and 30 action cards. Got what? it? What? 30? Then, Wait. let's use my cards. These were mixed in with all the others I had received. And I didn't know what they were for at first. But now that we've learned the rules, I can see that this one must be the Sucrose character card. I'm just... Why do they have a c cards of their own without them knowing, I guess? Or like, you know what the Sucrose card makes sense because it's, it was a gift for her. Then, then the Dino card that was made by Kaya? Or is got it for some, from Kaya got it from some? Now, it looks like we each have the Kaya, Diluc, each? and Sucrose character cards. So why don't we have our first duel? You say so? Wait, hold on, I need to Take your that. time. I look forward to our first duel. What this? Oh, oh. Hi, yo. Hi, yo. I don't know how to say that. You have not yet attained the status of official TCG. Yes, heed Prince's words. Besides, I need to keep mixing drinks for now. Okay, thank you, Shin. <laughs> Wait. I got water. Oh, 
all your fucking things is so cool. Oh, there's a lot. Wait, I don't like secrets the same. We have cards each. Wait, wait a second, my friend. Ready for our duel? Alright, let the duel begin! Oh. oh, oh god, that's such a cool one. Let's see. Switch, um... Oh, that's an energy. Oh, that's a good one card, I think. Just want someone to double save. Who, Tao? <laughs> just want... I don't know what that does. It's just a permanent. Unlike the adventure challenge you tried previously, duels are true tests of strength between two players. In a duel, your opponent can also use action cards, and they'll also be able to grab new cards during an end phase. At the same time, your opponent must also spend elemental dice to take actions, so you'll be unable to view their intent. <laughs> are you ready? It's time for some exhilarating fights to the bitter end. Mewza! Oh shit, wait. Ah. Do you look? Let's finish this oh, so swiftly. We so we choose the active character first and then. Roll. And roll the dice. Oh shit, what the heck? I don't have Kaya's. I should have changed that. Oh, that's that. I, I could have. Can I use whichever card? What's this? Yeah, that's the Geo dice. Where is the use of skill items? Should I use this? I don't know. I don't know should I write it? Imagine losing. Oh no. Choose one. What's the summon? I don't know what the summon is. Yeah, the C is this. Oh, I can use multiple cards. What does this do? Okay, there you go. That answers my question. Shit. Wait, I have one pyro dice though. Die. Oh, and round. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Ah, there we go. I don't have a die anymore. Oh, sorry. Those are so bad. So bad. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> that it matters. Ready when you are. Flashbacks from that night. <laughs> oh 
is it this guy? Oh shit. I don't know. How do I cancel that? I keep forgetting. I can't even use it. I can't use anything. Never mind again. I can heal, but... Wait, I have sucrose, oh my gosh. But I'm not gonna use her. <laughs> Am I? Oh, decent. I should check if I can, like... Yeah, you can. I can only uh, attack them. Wait, um, uh, Kai is gonna die. <laughs> dodge this! Oh, dodge this! He looks sad. Oh, I can use the uh, burst now. But that's. But not that. Not that I can. I'll use. I'll switch. Two. Oh shit. Let's finish this swiftly. Oh you're ending her around. Yeah, uh, okay. Where did I go? <sighs> Darn. I didn't factor that into the equation. This is a move. Ah, it was not just like you can use either one die or two other or two element types. It's the it's the combination of the stuff. So this is like three energy and four pyro die. Okay, I got you. Well, not that I can't do anything anymore. I don't have any more die. I see. Oh, yeah, Nico. That's a point. so cool. These are so bad. Okay, well, I mean, I'm not gonna use... Imagine that turns into trash. Oh, hey, I have three. Nice. I can't do... I can use the looks first. After... Dodge this! Kaya does... Oh, shit, the mouth. Yeah. Can I use anything? No, I don't he need heal. Kaya's words. I, I should change the other next character. Oh shit, it's. Uh, never mind. He's alive. Can I use. Wait, never mind. If I heal. Wait, if I use this, it ends, ends the phase. Uh. You? I don't know what I'm doing, seriously. I'll switch. Ready when you are. Okay, cause uh, the girls can't do anything anyway. Oh, but they're gonna. She's gonna get the first. Oh. Kaya might die. Oh no. Here we roll. Cryo, 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 cryo. Oh, on me. I should have said on me. Oh, so bad. Can I get my ones? What's this? Animal test 6308. Reduction phase begins great. Oh. 
Wait, no, use that. This. Oh shit, dumbass. Now what do I do? I know I can't do that. Oh shit, oh, this looks gonna die. Goodbye, dear look. Never mind, they ended the first round. Ah, uh, so I only have one. I might as well. Wait, it's gonna end now? Okay, come on. <coughs> My research has failed. Okay, that was, of course, it was a bit this calm. Because it's like, basically just also a tutorial. <sighs> I can't believe I lost when we had the exact same character cards. The rules must be more complicated than I first thought. I didn't even use the Sucrose character card. Every decision is a difficult trade-off in this game. If there was only a way to transplant the arms of the two standby characters onto the active character's body... True. <laughs> That's not how the rules work, Sucrose. Don't be a sore loser. That kind of thing is looked down on in TCG circles. Oh, I am sorry. I was beaten fair and square. I know that. I just can't stand losing. But it was a fun match. You went easy on me. It was a close call. Was it? <laughs> it went easy on I me. I didn't know you could get so competitive, Sucrose. I always get a little upset when I lose. It's like that with my research, too. It always gets to me when my experiments don't go as planned. Especially when there's an alchemy genius like Albedo around to compare myself to. Sure. Uh, you lost me at alchemy and experiments. But I'm pretty sure it's normal to feel that way. Uh, yeah, yes. Playing cards is no different. Each game you lose makes you want to win the next one to settle the score. And the desire to win pushes you to improve your strategy and build a better deck. <laughs> Seizing victory through a winning combination of luck, skill, and experience is where all the fun of genius and vocation lies. But what if you keep trying and trying and never win a single game? That's so sad. A losing streak, uh, yeah. That'll definitely get you down. But it's way better to keep trying until you win than to just accept you're a plain old loser and give up. It's like my sister playing her game. Hmm. You make a good point, Diona. Besides, Sucrose, you're already making great progress. It'd take at least eight of our regular booze hounds to match your level. You played well this last match. Agreed. It was a brilliant game. Thank oh, you. I'm just a little disappointed to lose, that's all. But Genius and Vacation TCG is a really fun game. Good! Having fun is the main thing. If you ever want to play again in the future, Feel free to come by the cat's tail. Uh, but don't expect me to play with you. I just mean, this place probably has the right atmosphere. I'll definitely be back. All right. I think you should have all the basics down by now. I need to get back to bartending. Sheehan's likely been busy making his tavern more popular with his delicious cocktails. Pui, pui, pui. And we can't have that. Pui, pui, pui. Huh. Burning Mondstadt's wine industry to the ground keeps me pretty busy, you know. So if you need any more help, go bother Shuyun. Okay. You good, Wonder? Seriously, what do I name you? Why do I have to name you? Why are you? Oh my gosh, there's people here. Why are you giving me the 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 the, 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 the right to na name you, you? I can't speak. Hopefully there's nothing here. Hi Shayan. I'm talking to you from behind. I run. Can I talk to you? Can. Yeah. I have to make drinks for the customers now. If you've got any more questions about Genius Invocation TCG, you can go ask Shunyan. He's over there. He is. I see. So you have now grasped the rules of Genius Invocation TCG. <laughs> That's right. The Traveler and Sucrose and Paimon are TCG players now. I didn't notice you play any matches, Paimon. Uh, 
Paimon picked it up from watching you and Sucrose. Sucrose. Wow. Becoming a TCG player is not as simple as that. You cannot call yourselves true TCG players until you have passed the test. Oh, sobering words from Prince there. But I'm afraid he's right. To become official players recognized by the Genius Invocation TCG Society, you have to pass the test. There's really a test? What does it entail? Sealing a Samakril within a deck of cards? It's just a tabletop card game. I'm not sure how you would plan on achieving something like that. There's someone with that power in fairy tale. Basically, Enemy. to become an official and recognized TCG player, you have to best three opponents in a duel. So, you have to win three duels against three different opponents? So, can I... do I have to just win two more now? The duel you just played can count towards this tally. Nice. I agree. Although I didn't get to observe the match myself, I did listen along. And from what I could hear, you both performed at a rather high level. So does it count to across? Same way you can hear what Prince says? A well-trained ear is a basic skill expected of anyone hoping to become a TCG master. But back to the matter at hand. Yep. The Traveler only needs to beat two more opponents to become an official TCG player. Guess as much. Sucrose, you may have lost the last duel, but don't be disheartened. I can assure you that winning three games is well within your ability. <coughs> but first things first, Shuyen. Before that, our TCG newcomers should receive their free gift. Ah, oh, yes, my goodness. Completely slipped my mind. I'm lucky to have Prince here to remind me. Everyone who wants to start playing Genius Invocation TCG is entitled to claim a free Casket of Tomes. Casket of Tomes? Or have I heard that before? Oh, uh, thingy. Tamei's yeah, mentioned it, didn't he? It was from the light novels he's been reading. The thing that the main character found in his attic. Oh, that's right! The soul of an ancient TCG player was trapped inside, right? So the Casket of Tomes is actually real? It's based on the game, so yeah. <sighs> well, actually, all card cases in Genius Invocation TCG are called Caskets of Tomes. Not only do they provide a reliable and sturdy container to store your decks, they can also sense when other people in the area are also oh. carrying a Casket of Tomes with them. Oh! Paimon can guess what you're gonna say next! The reason they can sense each other is because they have the souls of ancient TCG players inside! What? That would mean an extraordinarily high number of people in history <laughs> have been turned into disembodied souls as a consequence of playing card games? No. The real reason that it can sense other caskets is because it holds a nifty little mechanism invented by Sumeru scholars. What a letdown. Sounds like a convenient way of finding other t TCG players. Cool, TCG friend fighter. <laughs> all right, now let's see this casket of tomes already. Whoa. All caskets of tomes are issued by Margaret, so you will need to see her to claim yours. Probably for the best. If Prince and I were responsible for handing them out, knowing how eager we both are to promote the game, we'd probably have dished them all out by now. Okay. So go and see Margaret to claim your casket of tomes, hey, use Abby. it to find another player, beat them in a duel, and then come back here. But even for the Traveler, that's only two wins in total. What about the last one? I shall choose the final contestant she must beat in order to become an official TCG player, for it must be one of comparable prowess. Excellent plan, Prince. Happy dueling, both of you. Where's Margaret? Is she back? I have to leave. Too slow. Hello, you three. Has little Diona finished teaching you the rules of genius invocation? Ah, 
Ah, I see you're here for your casket of tomes, aren't you? <laughs> A very useful tool indeed. Whoa. I guess that stuff is the thingy. Mechanism. So this is a casket of tones. Mechanism. That's right. A purpose-built case for your card deck. That can even detect when someone else nearby is carrying one. Gosh, oh. whoever invented this must have seriously disliked being alone. <laughs> yeah, well, even the most fun game is pretty lonely if you got no one else to play it with. Genshin Impact? True. So I'm glad that these customers, um, <coughs> TCG players, are able to congregate at the cat's tail. Can't be bad for business. You're not wrong, but that's secondary. The important thing to me is the opportunity for like-minded people to come together and enjoy their favorite hobby. It creates a nice atmosphere. Anyway, now that you have your caskets of tomes, it's time to find some opponents. All right. In that case, I'll go find some people to play against, too. Let's meet back at the cat's tail in a while. Trust in your cards. You can win this. Thanks. I'll do my best. Why not start with Timaeus? <laughs> oh, shit. How can I get other cards? Wait. Do I have... Oh, shit. Okay, I have... I have to equip it, right? I mean, obviously, because we don't want to play, why? Join! Ah, oh, they're so cute! <laughs> I have no idea what's happening, but okay. How do I get the card? Can I get the cards? Oh wait, find a player first. Oh wait, so I don't have to equip it. Hmm? Oh shit, sorry, my mom. What were you saying? Continue! I thought you had a line where you, when you were interrupted, you say it, you still say it after. <laughs> Squall and Fury! Oops, me. Oh, yeah. Shooting. Aha! It's you! I'm sorry, is there anything I can assist the two of you with? We want to become official genius invocation TCG players! But we have to pass the test first, so we need to be three players in a duel. Our casket of tomes led us to you! Oh, I see. Unfortunately, yeah, I'm on saying. duty right now. <laughs> but it's time to 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 do all <laughs> When it comes to your attention that a citizen of Mondstadt is in need, you must come to their aid promptly and willingly. <laughs> Are you quoting the Knights of Favonius handbook at me? As someone who reads it, yeah. <sighs> so be it. Then let the duel begin. So efficient. Adventure challenge. Oh, adventure challenge. Cause there's an NPC. Oh, go. Okay. I'll switch. Oh, uh, I have Kaya, so. Oh, I'm gonna remove. Oh, I'm in it. Okay, I have Catalyst. But I might. Okay, sure, why not? I don't know. Let's just try it out. Oh, <gasps> draw two cards. The thingy. <laughs> Let's use Kaya for now. Ready when you are. Just so we can see. <laughs> so, so, seriously, the time I choose Kaya, you give me like a lot of pyro dice. Die. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. I don't know what this is, but I'll do it. Oh no! Don't do that. Never mind. What? what wait. Do I, what's the two cards here? The support stuff.
Oh shit, I, I used the wrong one. Oh my dumb. Oh my dumbass. No seriously, I'm a dumbass. <laughs> oh, what the What's this? Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> What's this? Next time. Okay, I'll do that. Wine is real. Okay, I'm a dumbass, seriously. Yeah, well. I really can't talk too much, too long. Oh no, Kaya! Oh, never mind. Thank you, that was bad. So satisfying. Dice? Dice is plural, right? I keep forgetting. Oh, what? That's such a waste to use uh, words there. So I won't. Okay, can I use anything here? What's this? Hey. Let's just use normal. Gonna die anyway. I wanna use the first one. Something. Someone, some, it, some. Now, now let's use the birds. This moment will be frozen in time. Okay, what? That was what damage? Sa, what? Seriously, I don't miss. If I end the round, it's like... It's useless. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where's what? <laughs> Wait, this is so fun. <laughs> I could've just like switched to something. <laughs> and it's still switched. Let's go. I haven't used the gross. Oh, it's a thingy. Bestie, Be Kaya, bestie, come on now, Kaya, bestie, Kaya, bestie. <laughs> Winding the round, I don't know. It's a one extra, <laughs> one hit every turn. I'm not using Sucrose. <laughs> I hope I get like Razor soon. Someday. I don't know how you get those. I forgot. I think you get it from Prince. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> Shift one idea from at most. <laughs> You're good. Well, I don't have energy for this, so I might as well. Oh, they're done. Sayonara. <laughs> I still can't try 
try again. Unless I can get coins again. Which I don't know if I can. Or you can. Oh, that's all? Why am I here? Gosh, I lost. You're remarkably good at this, oh. considering how new to the game you are. <laughs> Let's play again when you have some time. But ideally, not when I'm on duty. Thanks, Swan. We did it! Now we have two victories under our belt. Let's get back to the cocktail. Paimon wonders who Prince is going to pick as our final contestant. Keep reading your handbook. I really wanted to do the quest, but I seriously don't know why I'm so set on giving Wanderer a name. I sense that she had what it took to become an official TCG player, but she has returned to the tavern more quickly than I had expected. I think I took a bit too long, you know? Defeat the opponents I have arranged for you, and you shall become an official TCG player. I look forward to watching this game immensely. Not just Prince. I can't wait either. Come, your opponent is waiting for you in one of the private rooms. There's only one. She won't lose to them, or is it the other one? Is. Right, Traveler? Naturally. What ho, fellow <gasps> boy. Fishel! Cellar boy. Also, yes, there's there two, okay. I was briefly discountenanced when I heard the tidings of your sworn oath to become the thrice victorious. But so be it. You who are enslaved by dueling desire, be released from your shackles into the glorious arena of gladiatorial combat. Of course it is. Forth, oh brave challenger. Your princessin grants you an audience. Hmm. Hearken well. The wretched clock chimes yet again as the declining light of the day grows dimmer still. Pardon my directness. But we have not been waiting that long. Main Fräulein could afford to be a little less impatient. Uh, huh? Paimon knows those voices. Yep, it's like forest time. Unreconciled cell stars. The sum, no, the wine, the wine nice is The summertime. Now this one. Your opponent sounds anxious to begin. Do not delay. That's what Prince said. Please enter and enjoy your genius invocation TCG duel. Okay, I'm on the way. The traveler shows greater skill than most beginners, but Fischl displays greater prowess still. Oh, you really think so? I think the traveler has the edge personally. <laughs> Are you... Are you for real? I'm so confused whenever. Let's just go on with it. Hi! I should have taken a- <gasps> Wait! Wonder and television! Who else yeah. but the princessin? For, as the name of this hallowed rite suggests, only <sighs> when the wisest of heroes is summoned can the master of cards hope to be crowned the champion. This path is a treacherous one. It must be tread with great caution, for eternal doom and damnation are but one wrong step away at any given moment. That is why none is more suited to appear in this audience chamber than the princessin, <laughs> whose <laughs> Alg de Beertelong des Grossen Kaleidophantasmus has witnessed 10,000 battles across 3,000 worlds. Oh, is that right? They look so done. <laughs> ah, my bitter faces. Indeed. Main Fräulein has watched many games of Genius Invocation TCG and has gained a solid grasp of the rules. Even in a duel between beginners, it is best that both participants are well versed in them. Oh, that's true. A duel between beginners? When you say you watched many games. Ah, this makes sense now. Prince did say that he was going to pair us with someone of a similar skill level. Guess that means Fischl hasn't been playing that long either. Hmm. 
The princess needed but a single glance at these mere machinations of mankind to discern their working principles. Thus, with speed and brilliance paralleled by lightning alone, do I now arrive here at the gateway to yonder circle of secrets. Main Fräulein, too, has bested two opponents thus far, and is therefore one step away from becoming an official TCG player. So there's a lot on the line, huh? Either Fischl or the Traveler is gonna come out of this duel as an official TCG player! Indeed. Oh, the princess in herself heeds the call of fate and descends to this realm from the Immanachreich. Yet still, you dare to doubt the inevitability of the inevitable. Your stubborn foolishness is contemptible. Main Fräulein, I implore you to consider less odious turns of phrase, lest you be forced to feast on your words in the fullness of time. What? Uh, I shall not lose, Oz! What say you, Outlander? Do you wish to make an enemy of me, the Princess of Ertelung, who even now begins to strum the strings of fate that shall sound out the Traveler's Requiem? Verily, it's just time to duel. Then I say it is time to see what you are made of. Damn, okay. Wow, you look good. Why don't you have Razor? How dare you not have Razor? But it's adorable that we should last this card, damn it. Did I use the gross? What's my cards? So. Oh. I use it later. What's this? Oh. Oh, that's a good card. Let's finish this swiftly. Oh yeah, I just remembered that D looks and flies are flies first. Pick. Could be better, that's why. What was that again? I forgot. What do today use? <laughs> What did I use? I went. Help. I don't know what I did. Does it have the same card? The same element, I mean. Did reveal. Oh, that's a salmon. Cool stuff. I'm really taking too long. I can't do it with other people. I hope this slow. <gasps> Ready when you are. I yeah. am. Nice for me. Oh, I can't do anything anymore, so. Oh, <gasps> chat! Oh. Eh. I don't have anyone equipped with the weapon. I don't have any more dice, so. Card. Support card, I mean. Ah, stop. Animal? Should I is, is it time to use the girls? <gasps> Jeez. Oh, 
Baron Bunny. Very, very wide. Wait, what? Oh, wait, how? Just how many? Oh, how does that? That's no weirder than normal. Jack has needs three. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we did. Thank Freud. This is but a small sacrifice necessary to achieve ultimate victory. Okay. Sorry. Never mind. How do I change? Huh? What's this? Oh. What? I'm so confused. What did I do? Oh. Wait, you need two of the same element, so... Never mind, I'm a dumbass, seriously. I'm ending round, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm only playing with an NPC, well, because you know, well, <laughs> wait, I just want to play with that guy. Wait, the A. I almost confirmed that. It's scary. Two armies. That's so bad. Oh my gosh. Oh, never mind. They got. I can use the burst. Or I can't. Never mind. <gasps> Bennett! Kaya taught you stuff, okay? Oh, so sorry. So where did this like a turn this thing? Uh, uh, immediately? Death. Doesn't look good. <laughs> now see what happens to those who dare defy the princess in. I chill. Okay, obviously I gotta switch now. Never my they could they chose so close as my <laughs> What's this? Stand clear. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, it's an AoE thingy. Can I switch character? No, it's kind of a waste. Motion. I wonder if it's an AoE thing. Hypostasis emulation! Or just one. This is. Uh, what happened? Oz! With lightning, twixt upper and lower mandible! Strike thy pointy beak into this obstacle and remove it from my path! <laughs> Main oh Fräulein, I cannot simply attack the traveler. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so cute. Oh, I can do. So uh, useless, I think. Well, I mean, I might as well. There you go. 
Let's do V1. <laughs> let's let's say no. Oh shit. These are so bad. I was so close to greatness. this I can't why is Kaya's first button Might as well. <laughs> Let's finish this swiftly. I'm ready to switch. Oh, bestie. I'm so sorry, official. It's time to end this. Uh, Looks like I'm this official TC. Doesn't player. look good. <laughs> I'm taking too long with this. I'm taking too long. Oh, the cursed dragon looms near once more, casting its dark shadow on the slender threads of fate, hiding them from my vision. Traveler, was even this part of your plan? No. What a truly ingenious plot, and what an exciting duel to witness. Congratulations, you've won three duels now. That makes you an official TCG player. How about you? Yeah! Oh, Sucrose, you're back! Uh, does that mean... Yep, I've won two games so far. When I got back, I heard oh. you were in the middle of your final duel. Sucrose so I came over to watch. Do it. Nice! Take it down. Sucrose won two as well! Great work! You too. Hmm. It seems I am forced to admit, fellow Voyager of the Stellar Void, that you're... Mastery of the cards is second to none. To commemorate your glorious ascent to a battlefield beyond this lowly mortal realm, I grant thee an incarnation of my majesty in miniature. Huh? <gasps> your As card? you embark on this ingenious vocation, may you wield it in battle against Yay. all your fated foes, that not a single one of them may be left standing. Main Fräulein wishes to give you a Main Fräulein character card. No, where's where's the where wow, do you get these it's customized stuff? Card. I dare not take advantage of the princess's generosity. Tis a mere token of such. To the victor of this splendid duel is a boon of commensurate splendor due. Oh, um, excuse me, ma'am. I am hey. also a beginner who has won two games so far. Might I also have the honor of joining you in a duel? If you would be willing, of course. Nothing would delight me more. I hereby grant you permission to join me in performing the hallowed rite of genius invocation. One other thing. When I got back, Prince and Shuyun said there was something they needed to give you if you managed to become an official TCG player. Hopefully not an artist. Hopefully an instant victory card. Well, I want card another game card. In the world has a card like that. Paima bets it's some kind of prize for making it as an official TCG player. Let's go get our prize. Our prize? Okay, I'm going to get With three electro dice, I summon my eternal familiar, Osvaldo Krasnavine, to my side. Heed my. I'm a dumbass. But, Main Fräulein, I have been by your side all along. <sighs> I mean, in the game, Oz. <laughs> hmm. Then, I'll use Chaos.
chaotic entropy to invoke a large wind spirit that deals increased damage when it carries an element other than animo. So... Oh! So be it! One shall not be swayed by such a feeble attack! Okay, damn. Is that all? Guys. <gasps> so sad. I think someone is. Okay. What was I gonna do? Official and Sucrose are playing Genius Application TCG. Maybe it's best not to interrupt their game. I see mistake TCG. I have TCG. I should. Ah, oh, so it was you who won the duel in the end. I knew you'd do it. Congratulations! You are now officially recognized members of the Genius Invocation TCG community. My head hurts. Very well done. Now, I will explain to you what becoming an official TCG player entails. The first thing all new official TCG players receive is their TCG Player's Handbook. This handbook tells you exactly what you need to do to become a top-tier TCG player. Make sure you read it. Secondly, a range of Genius Invocation merchandise is now available for you to purchase here at the Cat's Tail. <laughs> so you see, becoming an official TCG player is really just the first step. And thirdly, whenever you wish to play a game with a friend, you can use the invitation board there. Whoever you wish to duel against, simply invite them to the tavern for a game. Invitation board? Yes, it's right by the bar counter. Once you get the hang of it, you can play with your friends whenever you want. That's it, really. If there's anything else you didn't quite understand, you can always come and ask me. Meow. Yes, indeed. I'm quite sure they will. Oh, sorry. I forgot to translate for you. Prince would like to say, Hope you have fun playing Genius Invocation TCG. Thanks, Prince and Shreya. <laughs> Gosh, it's taking me to ours. Oh, one ours and one iron for them and one ours. Visible yet invisible. You think I've got a sharp tongue? I just tell it like it is. If okay, thank you. someone can't handle it, maybe that's their problem. F eight, F seven, F six, or F six. All cool stuff. I guess I should. Hey, what's up? Is there anything I can help you with? <laughs> Ask a book there. I have a reward. Oh, Primo Jams. Whoop, whoop. He has a player from Fearless. Cool stuff. Ooh, animal. What's that? Oh, oh, never mind. I thought it was a. Wait, what's that? I was thinking. Oh, he does not So now... I am dead. I guess that's all. I have no idea if I'm doing it, but let's check. Port cards, event cards, Catherine! Just some. Oh wow! Oh wow! You can like cut so many of the cards. Oh, that's so cute. Uh, this. You know what? That was someone definitely can get all of these. Oh shit! Don't don't do that. Don't purchase them yet. 
So if I had the chance, I don't know. I am not too uh, set on getting some. This is hard. <laughs> Ten to nine stuff. Uh, where's Razor? There's Razor. Yep, there's. These are all the cards available in the web event that I saw. I got them all. Well, the, the character cards. I'm. I'm. I'm glad that Razor has his though. Seriously. Couldn't have signed him. I mean. Yep, it's normal then. Cool. Can I? Wait, I want to see all of the stuff. Of course, it won't do anything. It's just moving. So cool. Smokely. Wait, so I can't get the. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, I get 4,000 views. Wait, player level 5. Two guards, they're level 5. Oh, dynamic skins for them. Oh, it's just shiny. Huh? Okay. And that's uh, gold border, border, borders. Jeez. I'm not really too uh, set on these. Although I'm using the look. When you main the look in a game, or like card game. Should I buy anything? I already have that, right? Why does Timmy have a thingy? Oh, oh, that's a cool one. So girls and fish will probably do still checking it out. I could end it like right now, and I'll play one more. Oh, it's Marjorie. Let's go. Time is against us. Who says that time is against us? <gasps> oh, thank you. My gosh, how nice of you. I won't use suppose yet, so. Hey, would you look at that? Cool it. I'm so quiet. Cool it. I could 
use psychic like, cubes. I can't. What does this do? Let's try not doing it. <gasps> it's taken one minute anyway. Gee, thanks. I can't hear stuff. I could have used, like, I want to make it longer. I want to help. I could have, like, killed this in one go. Oh, but honey, you're dead. Absorption test. Ouch, my food. Ah, Why are you so close? <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh, you're better than the regulars here. <laughs> That's all. Squall and Fury! <laughs> oh shit, are the pigeons here? No, they're not. No, they are. Too late for regrets! Shift one energy from it. It's so cute. Wait, what the heck? This is. It's a family. <laughs> a guy and Albedo. What? Okay, sure. Wait, throw also fire up. I let's try some. I can do it. I'm sure you, you can. We can. Oh hey, it's uh, sign. Hey, would you look at that? Animal test sixty three oh eight. I'm 
was a waste. <sighs> Let's finish this swiftly. Yes. I think it's time to say goodbye. Burn. <laughs> That should be the last of this one. <laughs> it's your two hours. Whoa, how did I lose? Whoa. Whoa. Kaya, the audacity. Yay, we're done with this. What's this? I have no idea what that is, but it's okay. Wait, huh? The wind rises. <sighs> Quit following me. What? Uh, sure. That's ended. Yay, say goodbye, Walker. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with your name. Seriously. 